everyone, my name is Lorena Vargas and I'm a physical therapist. In this video, we're going to learn a movement sequence to help your child to move their shoulders and pelvis. I often use this sequence when the child has muscle tightness, spasticity, or has a hard time to move fluently. These movements can be used as a preparation for stretching and physical therapy. Let's start moving the shoulder up and down. You can do these movements five times each direction. This will help to give a gentle stretch to the neck muscles. Now let's do it back and forth five times. Then you can move the arm up and down. One of the goals of this sequence is to dissociate body parts, which means in this case that the arm can move separate from the rib cage. Now with the arm forward and up, give a gentle roll back and forth on the rib cage. Do it five times. Let's start with the pelvis and move it separate from the trunk. Stabilize with this hand here and the other hand on the pelvis moving it back and forth. Another way to move the pelvis is placing this foot on the ground with the knee up. This will also help to prepare the feet for standing because it gives them sensory input as well as range of motion to the ankle. If it is hard to maintain the knee up, or if there are many restrictions in the hip, you can place the knee on a pillow or roll towel and move the pelvis. When your child is on their back, you can grab both knees and bring them to one side while stabilizing the opposite shoulder so it doesn't go where the pelvis is going. You can hold this for 15 to 20 seconds. Now you can repeat this movement sequence on the other side. 